So welcome back to the channel, everybody. Thanks again for tuning in. Uh, you've tuned in for another first time Let's Play video. Uh, it's a series of where I pick a game off my shelf that I haven't played before, and we try it for the very first time together. Um, today's game is going to be an NES game, and it's a recent purchase. Uh, re uh, my reason for doing it is because on the label, it's an IREM game. Um, for those who are not familiar with IREM, I mostly associate them with being shooters, like shoot 'em ups um, They've done other such games as, well, for NES, uh, they've done the very well done, uh, though the PC Engine version is a lot better. But this is the NES version of Image Fight. So this one came out in 1990. No, this was 89, sorry. And then they've also done for a PC Engine, um, Mr. Heli, which is a fun, uh, not only side scroller, but as well as horizontal uh, shooter. Uh, this one's really good, really hard game though. I don't know if anyone's tried it. So two good games from Image Fight. That's what I'm basing the reputation on for at least what I've played prior. So that's why I grabbed this one. Uh, this game is Kickle Cubicle. So I don't know much about it, except from what I've done as research online. It's a low, low type of game. Uh, if you're, and when I say low, low, it's like a sliding puzzle game. So basically, like, there's a wicked wizard, um, and he covers the kingdom in ice and hides these palaces within the ice for some reason, like the palaces and the um, citizens, and it's your job to help, I guess, break them out. From what I can see online, uh, there's four um, lands or worlds that you have to uh, rescue or solve. The garden fruit cake and toy lands um, so each one of them has about 17 or 18 puzzles in it uh, there's a there's a front label there so if you beat all and there's also like a special stage or stages with 30 or more puzzles in it so it is a quite a long game now i've played lolo uh, not recently though so i can't recall if that's as long a game as this one but I thought this would be a good addition to the collection. It's Irem, so it must mean that it's quality. Um, I don't know too many Irem games, or at least that I can think of at the moment, that are not worth playing or trying. So without further ado, um, let's take a look at, for the first time together, uh, Kickle Cubicle for the NES. All right, guys, so we're gonna check out some Kickle Cubicle here for the first time. Hopefully, uh, the gameplay is good here. Presented by Irem. Irem on the label, quality on the table. All right, so a nice bright screen there. Kick off cubicle. Start in three, two, one, go. Garden land. So this is the first world. Does remind me of. This reminds me of Lolo, even though I couldn't tell you last time I played Lolo. And so A does. Uh, what does B do? B shoots. Those are nice. Oh. Okay. Okay, so we had eggs there that the enemies would pop out of. And we collected three treasure bags. So this one has two treasure bags and some ice cream. Three treasure bags. Not interesting. My controller is uh, super wonky here, guys.
I don't know if this thing does it blocks enemies in. Alright, so I gotta build a bridge across. Oh. Yeah, that wasn't me guys, this controller is garbage. Should get a better controller. Fuck. Piece of shit controller. It's always the controller's fault, right? Never forget that, kids. When in doubt, blame the controller. What happened to that guy? I froze there. I ate him or something? Yeah, I don't know. Game plays. What? Beautiful Fantasy Kingdom is now under the rule of the uh, Wizard King. Ravishing palaces were hidden and these islands were made to confine us. Kickle, please get back to palaces and revive the fantasy kingdom. So says the corn of Cobb. Okay. So I gotta do this whole map thing here? Oh, I'll smoke the bitch. If that's my controller, I'm pressing right and it was going up. points. Hmm. And kill the bad guys. There we go, baby. One, two. Now we got green peppers flying around. bad. It's a fun little puzzle, I guess. My, my complaint is my stupid uh, controller is not very responsive. Oh boy. My controller is fucked. Doesn't let me turn. Alright, I gotta buy a new one. Like Little bridge this way. Game over. Eight points. It's okay. It seems to be the same strategy, though. We're always shooting it up. Oh, it ain't now. It's going this way. I was going to say, the strategy seemed pretty repetitive. Oh. 
What happened? All right, continue. Oh, there's springs on the side there. That's why I bounced in there. Okay. Different kind of strategy. This side, uh, pumpkin. <sighs> My controller was better. This game would be going a lot quicker. Uh-oh. Get that chicken. I wish I can't go in that hole, right? Nope. So... Do I die if I go in the hole? Watch out! Okay. I think I got it. Hey, you see what that guy did? I gotcha, okay. Okay, I figured it out. Come on. There we go. All right. It's not bad. I'm, I'm really trying to because when I'm when I'm playing Irem games, I'm used to them being like shooter games. That's what I associate with like shoot 'em ups for Irem. Holy shit, this one's... This one's like a bitch. Oh! What the? What did I just do? What is that thing? Controller is wonky, but is that it? Right? All right, this should be the last life. Well, guys, this is Kick Old Cubicle. Not bad, you know, cute, cute for what it is, I guess. Nine forty-three. First time I played it. Uh, what does the password look like? PCLG, okay. Not very difficult. Alright, thanks for tuning in, guys. Uh, until we do another Let's Play, we'll see you guys again very soon.